Hey everyone, my name's Silver, and welcome back to my channel. So today guys, I'm here with my thoughts, or a top 5, I guess, as it would be called, for the new Link Joker booster box that's coming out this year, or next year, we, uh, in America, or in English, we don't really have a release date yet. So, yeah, as you know, Link Joker got some support, and I honestly can't wait for it. I'm super excited, and here... This is sort of my top fives I'd like to see improved upon in the box. So a lot of this you already know about because it's listed in there or it's listed in the description. But I'm going to voice some of my opinions and see where it goes from there. So coming in at number five um, is Infinite. So Infinite is a sub part of the Star Vader line. And I honestly don't know too much about the Infinite so I really don't care but I know a lot of people would like to see it and maybe giving infinite uh, a new stride would be really good something that maybe is towards the end of the game where it's a finisher where you lock everything and you gain power or criticals some um, but overall I'm not too big of a fan of him I really don't care if infinite gets support so that would be why it's at number five and yeah so tell me what you guys think about infinite getting support yay or nay down in the comments below um, moving on to number four so even though this is really uh, far down on the list out of the top five it is one of my favorite deck builds and it is Glendios so when moving on to Glendios stuff um, Glendios just needs a better support than what it got last time it literally got a stride unit uh, even so um, I love the deck build to start off with, but I'm hoping to see a new grade 3 Glendios that works off of a GB2 skill and a stride skill. And maybe it could even be called Starvader Alpha Glendios because the original was Omega. And it could run off of having Omega in the soul or something like that. Um, but overall it could be pretty awesome to see Galendios getting some support like that. A new stride would also be really cool, maybe based on the same name. But, uh, again, maybe the stride skill could be if you have a Omega in heart, search your deck for X amount of reverse units. And then your stride can be essentially Omega skill, alt wind skill. But that is my number four for Glendios, and I really hope that Glendios gets a lot of support coming up. Um, moving on to number three. Now, honestly, I debated if number three and number four should be swapped around when I was thinking about these. But um, I left them in this order. So we obviously know Messiah is getting support, and probably a lot of it. We're probably going to see SP packs with the resters, new, the criticals and stuff. But I do have a link down in the description below talking about this I've talked about Alter Ego Messiah getting a new grade 3 like Alteration Messiah or Alteration Ego Messiah I have a handful of names in that video so I don't want to spend a lot of time talking about it but I will give an idea I would like to see it have a I'd like to see some of the new Messiah stuff to have um, soul charging engine for your Messiah's soul blast 2 skill which is every time a unit unlocks you Soul Blast 2 and draw a card, which makes the deck very powerful, so I'd love to see some more of that. That would be fantastic. And yeah, so like I said, down in the description below should be a video link f to my Messiah video on new things. If it's not, then it's on my channel. Very easy to find. And I plan on doing more stuff like that in the future, so let me know if you like it. So moving on to number two, and number two is by far one of my favorite lines in the Star Vader universe, and that is Chaos. So yeah, I'm hoping that Chaos gets some awesome support. I plan on, I have another video planned talking about more Chaos support in the future if I can find some or so on, but I believe that a lot of these older clans with Limit Break should get new GB2 skills and new on stride skills. Because it would make it nice and fun and awesome. And please, please, Bush Hero, give us on stride skills for newer units. Now, I don't know if you should change the name, because that would mean you have to change uh, Chaos Break or 
a chaos break, whatever it is, the um, the supporting unit for for Starvader Chaos Breaker Dragon. I believe it's Breaker, right? Um, I have I have its name somewhere on my desk. Give me a second. Boop. Oh, oh, there it is. So yeah, it is Starvader Chaos Breaker Dragon. Yep, just like I thought. Um, so yeah, there's that. That would be really cool to see. A uh, new form. And before we move on to the number one slot, I would like to have some honorable mentions that did not make this list. We have, um, what is it? F Freeze Ray would be awesome to see some support for Freeze Ray. Freeze Ray. Um, some awesome support for the Legion units would be amazing. And yeah, so those are the two honorary, honorary mentions I have, but I believe I have a handful more. If you want to wait one second, if not, just skip ahead. Um, honestly, reverse units should come out of this pack, but that's my opinion. Okay, so here are my last three. I forgot I had these written down on a separate sheet of paper. So um, I'd like to see, again, Freeze Ray and i'm sorry guys it's pretty late my brain died freeze ray and the other thing i said earlier which was something i'd also like to see oh yeah it's the legion stuff the uh star Vader legion stuff i'd like to see blaster joker get some support i'd like to see garnet star um setting sun star Vader. um i'd like to see star Vader reverse get some support um, I'd like to see Star Starvader Dark Band Dragon get support, and I believe that was it. I think yes, that looks to be it on my list of things. So those are the things I'd like to get support. And real quickly, guys, before we move on to the number one slot, um, if you look down just above the description, there it says a subscribe button. If it's red, that means you are not subscribed and you're missing my upload content so hit it turn it white or whatever color is the default for it now because YouTube's always changing its platform so in four weeks it might not be even red anymore so yeah hit that subscribe button let me know if to stay in tune for future update videos theories and other things like that of relativity so moving on to the number one slot drum roll please all right that was terrible and finally so guys, this is by far my favorite sub clan for deleters, or for link jokers. It's deleters, if you can tell by my major mess up there. So yes, deleters. Um, right now they need support. They absolutely need an on stride. They need a new stride. Something early game, not late game. We need more units that banish delete, because honestly, I feel like that's deleter one of deleters' strongest suits. Um, we need a permo delete skill. What I mean by that is we need a delete skill that when your opponent's stride unit strides, it does not undelete. So striding and riding will not undelete it. I mean, well, riding technically deletes it. So what I'm thinking is, is they give deleters a unit that when it strides, you may pay, you know, a heavy cost or a unit or a stride unit. So by paying the cost, you delete your opponent's vanguard and you... Omega delete, I guess, would be the term. I don't know. The work on progress in that one. So let me go know what you guys think of what that should be. But essentially, it deletes it. So when your opponent strides, it doesn't um, undelete itself. So the Vanguard becomes a 15k attacker. And you shouldn't be able to ride. And I think that makes it fair because right now, a lot of people, and this happened to me at regionals last year when I played deleters, um, Nova Grapplers have really awkward wording and someone cheated and I didn't realize until after my match was done but essentially Victor's skill is when it gives it to your vanguard so I had deleted my opponent's vanguard they had stride undeleted and then used his skill at the time I was not made I didn't comprehend it it was really hot I was tired so I let it go unnoticed but as soon as my match was over I realized I'd messed up and didn't read the wording right and he won off of that technicality so and he knew he admitted to me after I brought it up to his attention I saw him later that day that 
he was doing that, and honestly, I was leaving, so I didn't feel like reporting him to a judge. But you know who you are. I'll get you one day. This I swear. So, yes, the leaders need a new grade 3 with a new GB2 skill and a new stride skill. They need support. I want support for the leaders. I love the leaders. It was my first Link Joker deck I ever built. I really love them. They're awesome. They're amazing. But, yeah. Um... You lose momentum as soon as your opponent's vanguard's undeleted. Their, um, their unique perfect guard that re-deletes a vanguard is useless when your opponent strides. So maybe get a give us a G guard that deletes your van your opponent's vanguard. That'd be cool. Um, yeah, we just need really first turn stride. We have one deleter stride, which is good, but it's only good if your opponent's at thirteen banish. So we need to work on that. But overall, guys, that's it. Thank you all for watching. It means a lot to me. And please, again, if that subscribe button is red, that means you're missing out on my videos. Click it. Come join me on this fun, fun adventure of Vanguard news, theories, and games. I plan on doing a lot more. Tell me what else you guys like to see down in the comments below. I have a lot planned for this. But until next time, I've been the Silver Wolf. I will see you all later. Peace.